Alan Chastney rose to political prominence in 2013 when he became the political leader of the opposition United Workers' Party, sidelining former Prime Minister Stevenson King, who was later relieved of the post of leader of the opposition as well. Chastney proceeded to impose his vision on the United Workers' Party, ostracizing some long-standing members of the party whom he felt did not fit in with the new outlook for the old party. It all seemed to have gone according to plan with the United Workers' Party under Alan Chastney's leadership, defeating the incumbent St. Lucia Labour Party at the June 6, 2016 general elections. Fast forward five years to 2021 and the United Workers' Party, following one term in government under the leadership of Alan Chastney, suffered one of its most humiliating defeats at the polls in the UWP's long and proud history. My party it will not be a party for a long time. Now, according to some former United Workers' Party parliamentarians, the days of Alan Chastney at the leadership of the UWP are numbered. The business you have to deal with are the people who are in your party planning to take you out sooner than later. That is your business. Deal with it. Opposition Senator Fira Polius was questioned about the alleged moves to oust Alan Chastney from his leadership position. I cannot comment on this. I am not one of those, but I cannot say anything much about that. Senator Polius was pressed on her allegiance to the leader of the opposition. She says she is keeping faith in Alan Chastney. You on the record uh, affirm your support for Mr. Chastney as a political leader? This is my leader. I believe in him. And I believe that he has the wherewithal. He has what it takes to lead the party. Senator Dominic Fede was emphatic in dismissing the suggestion of moves to replace the UWP leader. That's an absolutely ridiculous assertion um, that can come from someone who is no longer within the United Workers Party. Um, you know, this is all about revenge. This is all about people being bitter. Um, the delegates of our party made a decision back in 2013 when they... Um, democratically and overwhelmingly chose Mr. Chastney as our um, political leader and you know they are very uh, justified in what they have done and it is something that uh, they did three times he went uh, in a convention following the 2016 elections and you know we are 100 percent behind him. Senator Herod Stanislaus dismissed the suggestion of a plot to remove the UWP leader. Honorable um, Alan Shastner is the political leader, leader of the opposition. Um, this is a gentleman um, we've worked quite um, well with for the past five years. He's well respected in the party. He has a great vision for the country. And these are just rumors of persons wanting to get rid of um, Mr. Shastner. We have an upcoming convention. The delegates of the party at that um, time will decide who is going to be the, the next leader of the party. For now, Alan Chastney's place in the party seems secure. Whether there are moves afoot to replace him and how effective those moves will be, will be known at the upcoming United Workers' Party convention. Stan Lucien for the HGS News Force.